Hello, we are Group 3, and we're here to present to you the things that you need to know about the two different energy processing organelles, the mitochondria and the chloroplast. First of all, where can these be found? Well, while the mitochondria can be found in organisms like animals and humans, chloroplasts are found in plants. And since they are found in different kinds of organisms, their functions differ in a way, as mitochondria have three different functions. First of all, it produces adenosine triphosphate, or ATP for short, which is a complex organic chemical that can be found in all forms of life. It basically acts as a storage for oxidized food that provides energy for the cell. Next is apoptosis, which is the death of the cell as the mitochondria basically decides which cells are to be destroyed with caspase, one of the chief enzymes involved in the destruction of cells during this process. And finally, it stores calcium for when the organism needs it the most, as this is something used a lot in the body, especially during fertilization, blood clotting, and muscle function. And on the other hand, chloroplasts, other than its contribution of making most plants and leaves green, also have other functions within the plant cell. First of which, it is responsible for the process known as photosynthesis, which basically converts lighter energy into organic molecules like sugar, for organisms like plants and algae to use as food. And second of which, it produces amino acids and lipid components that are necessary for chloroplast membrane production, which is also assigned in storing food energy. But after everything that was discussed, what makes these things important and what would happen if these didn't function the way they are now? Well, it's in these kinds of organelles name. Energy. Energy is something really important for organisms and cells to have as this basically drives them to do what they have to do, whether it is work, produce, and even keep things alive. If these organelles were to stop functioning at some point, organisms wouldn't be able to have the energy that they need to fulfill their niche, as most likely, they would just end up dead. Such as if a plant's chloroplast were to stop working, photosynthesis would never happen and would lead to a chain reaction of herbivores not being able to eat and us humans not being able to eat these animals. So yeah, again, dead. Overall, energy processing organelles are very important in our lives as it keeps us energized, healthy, and growing no matter what organism you are. Thank you for listening and don't forget to breathe.